Hey guys, this is Jess with another video. Um, as you can see, I'm not hooked up into the computer because I am happy to announce that the dev team has released their newest version of uh, Red Snow, which allows you to do an untethered jailbreak for any of the older devices. Now, this doesn't work for iPhone 4S or any other A5 devices, um, so you're still waiting for a, a jailbreak in general for that. But just to show you that this isn't fake, I'm going to go ahead and reboot my device. Now, it will stay on that screen for a little while. It'll take a while to reboot, but it does reboot, and I will confirm that um, it works. And I'll show you that I am on iOS 5.0.1. But uh, if you want to go ahead and s skip ahead through the video, um, you can. But I will assure you that this isn't fake. This is the untethered jailbreak that was released. Um, I believe it was this morning. But, um, so, if you already have the tethered jailbreak, you can install the new Cydia package that they have released. Um, it's called Corona, and it's the untether. Um, if you don't have the latest version, you can install the newest version of Red Snow, which is the 0 0.9.10. Um, and it will allow you to do the untethered jailbreak. So, as soon as this is ready to unlock. So I'll just go to settings and show you that I am indeed on 5.0.1. As you can see, I am on iOS 5.0.1. And as you saw in the very, very beginning of this video, um, it does do the reboot without being tethered. So, um, if you have any questions, feel free to ask. I will answer them to the best of my ability. And uh, if you want a link to where you can download the newest version of Red Snow, I will leave um, that in. I will leave a link in the description for you to go to that. Um, but again, this is for um, almost all of the older devices. I don't know if it works for every older device in every version that you're on, but um, this is the 5.0 and 5.0.1 jailbreak.